as I was pondering about this grace issue going on with the remnant here on YouTube and you know I in the past I have heard the word cheap grace okay um, I've never heard the word cheesy grace <laughs> that was a new one to me um, cheap and cheesy to me would have been when they cast the lot for his clothing back then you know <laughs> that reminds me of cheap and cheesy um, then I heard the words zomb zombie like grace when I listened to Katie did's video and I'm like Z what zomb I mean where are they coming up with this zombie like grace well that would have um, reminded me of Barabbas because I mean he clearly looked like he was completely out of it um, and then I went to a channel and I heard greasy grace <laughs> that was just revolting to me greasy grace that would also fall on the part of Barabbas because he didn't look very good to me and um, then I was thinking about you know when they were nailing his feet and hands to the cross do you think that the disciples were thinking wow that sure is cheap of him hey that's really cheesy you know hey you know he sure looks greasy on that cross <laughs> no and do you think that when they watched him watch them raise the cross up that his mother was thinking the same thing no she was weeping because I mean she wasn't protesting but she was on her knees weeping because she was humble and that's where this whole thing comes to is who is humble out there so they can learn the truth you have to be humble and you have to come to him as a child in childlike faith and I don't know I just wanted to say what I was given and led to about that subject but um, I finally got my video software up and running again because I in the past I love to make videos um, you know with scenery and stuff like that so I'm working on a, a video and it make you know that's kind of like the gifting that God has given me I'm sorry here goes a truck <laughs> um, but the Lord did put in my spirit to write a poem about how he felt and how I felt and I have always loved poetry and have been gifted in that as well so I'm going to read that and it starts out like this I asked myself <clears throat> the other day why Jesus loved us so. My heart was weak and weary like frozen flowers in the snow. The wind was soft and delicate as I watched the sun go down. And later, as I was still to hear, I watched the moon light up. I gazed upon her glowing beauty and caught a shooting star. The heavens above me made it clear 
about his wondrous love. And it was then I realized how wide his love has been. For he has wrapped you from your birth in his own blanket called the universe. But the part of him who took my sins was evident and clear. His grace had started eternity. And his love remains secure.